Mike, thank you so much. It is Foodie Friday here at KMIR 6 today. And JW Marriott's Rockwood Grill executive sous chef is with us, Joshua Murray. Thank you so much for joining us on Foodie Friday here at KMIR 6. So all morning long, you were showing us how to make these two dishes. So tell us exactly what you made here. Well, once again, we have what we have here is a very simple salad. Um, it's a heirloom tomato and avocado salad. And again, this is really taking the best ingredients you have to work with and uh, really kind of seasoning them up nice and light and keeping it fresh and delicious. And then over here to the left, uh, what we prepared is a uh, pan seared Pacific long line caught halibut. Um, and then we also have a carrot ginger puree um, and then a little bit of sauteed asparagus. And it's just finished off with a little bit of a daikon radish sprout. Um, so if you want to go ahead and give it a taste here let's and then let's see what we think. You can also do the halibut on the grill, right? So a lot of people grilling right now. Yeah, you can. You know, grilling it's a way to keep a little bit less fat in it. But, mm. you know, when you get a nice sear on it. Mm. It's it fantastic, very good. but you get that nice citrus mm. notes and everything out of this it. This is as great well. for the, the valley because, of course, it's hot here. This has lemon, it feels really refreshing. And the basil, very fresh. Mm, I Absolutely. like that. Very good. Absolutely. And I'm going to try a little bit of that. Uh, can I just dig yeah, right dig, in? Dig right into that. All right. Let's see. Halibut. Yummy. Now, the thing with halibut, sometimes for me, I don't know about, uh, obviously, you're a professional here, but it's hard to cook fish because it's hard to know when it's overcooked or not. So what kind of tips do you have for cooking well, fish? Well, the one thing that I think where people kind of get in trouble with fish is that mm -hmm. um, it is something that carry over cooks quite a bit. So, mm -hmm. you know, you don't want to necessarily take it to it's completely done. You want to let it get close and then just let it rest a little bit. And then it really will come in nice and, and be nice and uh, moist for you. Mm, that is so good. I really like that. This puree. I need a, another bite of this puree. <laughs> mm, great flavor. Fantastic. Thank you, Joshua, so much it. for joining us. And um, we're going to get the information up for Rockwood Grill. So if you want to go visit Joshua and the entire staff at Rockwood Grill, they have some great summer specials right now, yeah. great summer dishes. Um, and you can also win a gift certificate for two for Rockwood Grill. So go to our website, kmir6.com, click contest, and you have a chance to win dinner for two at Rockwood Grill grill and so you have some special prices for the summer right um well yeah we are we, you know i think that's one of the things that you know can kind of be misconceived is you know us being a jw and being a resort our prices are very comparable to the other restaurants in the valley as well and uh you know some of the nice summer features have a little bit more spice to them to get mm. that heat going and get you sweating a little bit um you know we have the uh, habanero honey glazed chicken bruschettes and then we're mm. also featuring a uh, a beautiful uh, grilled spring lamb chop as well so mm. um you know Sounds come great. on down we've really modified a lot of our menu for the summertime and embracing a lot of the vegetables that the valley has to produce wonderful Joshua, thank you. Delicious meal. Thank you for sharing it with us and for joining us on Foodie Friday.